The governor signed three bills from this month's special session into law. The chief purpose of the session was to shore up the state's budget following the economic downturn caused by COVID-19 and plummeting oil prices. Senate Bill 5 was designed to do just that by cutting millions meant for road and infrastructure projects. Meanwhile, Senate Bill 4 creates provisions for the November general election to protect voters and poll workers from COVID-19. It allows county clerks to mail out absentee ballot applications to voters automatically. It also gives the Secretary of State and Secretary of Health the power to enact further provisions as needed. House Bill 5 establishes a bipartisan civil rights commission to come up with recommendations for addressing excessive force involving law enforcement. One issue, it will examine whether to keep the practice of qualified immunity, which protects officers from being sued personally.